Mark, we've been talking about the uh, future of energy this morning. What do you think are the, the big challenges facing the industry? I think in the short term we need to uh, get back to a, a, a situation where there's real consensus to ensure that we get the investment required to uh, manage the trilemma of security, supply, affordability and decarbonisation. And uh, going up to uh, a general election uh, in 2015, are there any, um, what do you want to see from the, the political parties to, to give a bit more stability and encourage more investment? Well obviously the, the uh, completion of the energy bill through Parliament uh, is key. Uh, we want to see uh, what emerges in terms of how the capacity market is going to work. Uh, going forward uh, and we just want to make sure that there is a stable regulatory and political environment to ensure that the investment that's crucially needed uh, for the UK actually uh, comes in. Have you been encouraged for anything you've seen from the debate this morning, uh, particularly with Caroline Flint from the Labour Party here? Um, I think I'm encouraged by the uh, consensus uh, of the importance to ensure that we have a fully functioning and well-regulated energy market.